Hi everybody. So I do have a new video for you guys. It's a discussion and it's a pretty easy one. What is the anime that's touched you the most? This could have been made you feel good about yourself, made you want to do something good, made you cry, made you happy. What anime was it? Or what anime basically put you in someone else's shoes? <clears throat> or you saw yourself in another anime character's shoes? Um, for me, I definitely do have a few. One of them is Peach Girl. The um, reason why I choose that one the most is because I definitely really related to um, Momo in a few ways. Um, well, for Momo, it wasn't really so much her personality or how she was, but it was kind of like how she was with her best friend. Her best friend was kind of a backstabber, and while I didn't have any friends that were backstabbers, um, I did have an individual that it felt like everything that I got or everything that I wanted, they wanted. Or that they were always the ones that everyone kind of stood up for, and they thought that I was the bad guy, which still kind of happens. Um, but that's why I most related to that character in that show. Um, May Tashibana as well in Say I Love You, I also have to agree with. Um, because when it came to May, she definitely was much more kept to herself. And I'm, one of, I'm someone that's just like that. I mostly keep to myself a lot of times. But there are moments where after a while, once you get to know me, I can be very loud and outgoing and very talkative. But I always revert back to that state of mind where I'm basically kept to myself, mostly if I don't know anybody in certain situations. Um, but as far as besides characters with actual animes that have touched me, um, Angel Beats has got to be one of them. Just because it was a, definitely a weird look to look at the afterlife or that weird limbo between you basically recognizing the fact that you are dead and that you're gonna have to pass on at some point and basically just how those characters all were reacting to it and how they were rebelling against it um that show very much touched me um Clonad is actually also another one I Clonad after story I know a lot of people think of that one a lot um just because it had many different characters that had many different storylines and some of them were really sad some were really happy um and the last one I can also think of is Anahana, the flower we saw that day. And I think it's mostly because of the fact I've had a friend pass away before um, that I really wasn't ready for. And it devastated me when it first happened. And for a long time, I thought about the individual. And even now, I still think about it because I remember the day this individual passed. I remember this individual's birthday. Um, so that one really, punch, really punched me, touched me as well. Um, just because it makes me think about what would it be like if they came back around and they had one last wish that they really wanted me to fulfill. Those are the ones that's touched me the most. And I know it's kind of like a depressing topic, but it's not. It's just because all of us have a different reason of why we watch anime. Or a different reason of the animes that we like and the reason, the ones that we keep going back to to rewatch. So for me, around high school... Or on High School Host Club, I always go back and rewatch that show. Always. Um, I think it's because it's so funny, but it's also because it's a high school show. And it makes me wish my high school was like that. Or that I went to a high school like that. Or that I was like that in high school. Um, that's much more the reason why I go back to that show all the time. And it's always funny. And it can always put me in a really good mood, even when I'm upset. But that's why I always pose the question, you know, what anime basically has touched you the most or what character has touched you the most or related to the most. Um, I really want to know that because, like I said before, we all watch anime for different reasons. We all do. Whether it's as a favorite pastime, something to uh, take our minds off of our everyday life of what's going on. Some of us watch it because we it helps us to make new friends. And some of us watch it just because. For me, like I said before, I watch a lot of anime just because because I, it's very interesting, it's very different, and it's very new. Uh, but I also watch a lot of the ones that I've seen before over and over again because it's always touched me. And it's always made me think back on either where I've came from or where I want to go. And the different things that I want to do. Um, for example, I would have never started this blog or started this YouTube channel without watching anime. 
I also would have never made a lot of friends that I've made now without me watching anime either. So yeah, that's the question I posed for you guys today. What anime has touched you the most? This includes characters. This can even include voice actors in those animes as well. But I want to know. So definitely comment down below and let me know what animes have touched you the most. I'm very interested to see what you guys have to say. And like always, I will also try my best to comment back. I know I don't comment back immediately, but I always try to. All right. So I'm going to leave all my social media uh, links down below in the description box. It's going to be for my Instagram, my Twitter, my WordPress blog, and also my Ask FM. Once again, feel free to ask me questions on there. I like to answer them. Um, all right, you guys. So that's what I'm going to leave you guys with today. Um, I'll have a new video out for you guys next week on Wednesday, like always. Um, this one, next video, I promise, will be a little bit more happier, especially because it's going to be nearing Thanksgiving, which is a great holiday. All right, so I'll talk to you guys all soon. Once again, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. And if you're new to this channel, welcome. I hope you guys all enjoy. All right, hope to talk to you guys soon. Enjoy this video. All right, love you guys all.